So here we go, this is Explosive 3 and in the ring we've got Malik Ali on the home team making a return after seven long years and Kev Hall on the away team in the blue corner. This one, as the name suggests, will be Explosive. Fighters touch gloves, just sizing each other up there. Malik taking his time there, like I said, it's seven long years since Malik's been in the ring. Kevin misses with a right hook there. Southpaw versus Orthodox, Kev Hall just feeling with the jab there. And here we go. Oh, here we go, this is a great start by Malik and he's got him down! Referee giving him the standing eight count. What a fantastic start by Malik. Seven years away from the ring. Fighters touch gloves. This will be an amazing story for Malik, who, like I say, has been away for seven years. Took this fight at short notice, throwing the hands or throwing the combinations. Kevin himself just trying to figure him out here. And Malik again on the offensive, throwing those right hands. Good work so far by Malik Ali. Kevin again just finding himself in the ring here. Kevin switched to the orthodox stance there. And these boxes trade some leather. Malik's, Malik's backs him up against the ropes here, throwing the combinations. Look at those hands, good body shots there by Malik. Uh, Kev just in the corner there, just reaching out with the left hand. Looking ready for the counter and that's the end of the round, ladies and gentlemen. Great start for this night of boxing here in Middlesbrough. Okay, here we go, seconds out, this is round two. Here we go, the fighters once again touch gloves. Will we get more of what we saw in the first? Kevin was of course knocked down in the first, so he really needs to step things up. He's gonna take the victory here, three two minute rounds. Good shot there by Kevin, Malik answers with a flurry of combinations, body shots and he's got him again, I think this time it is over, referees counting him out here, four, five, six, seven, eight, and it's over, Malik Ali triumphantly returns to the sport ladies and gentlemen. Because I'm